Scanning. Neuroimaging shows your psychoactive potential is at all. Oh, wrong level. one. You. Diagnosing. Hello. Okay, so now that we've actually finished one objective, I guess. I don't know. What else is there to do? Neuroma division? I could. When did I. Oh, debriefing room? Hmm. We can't go back to Neuroma division. We could do that. Josh Dalton, we put an offer now. Reporters. Talus 1 lobby, how about this one? This one should be. Yeah, this one should be where we're headed towards. And the objective, that little marker will tell us anyway. Oh, what is it? oh that's still on Josh Dalton. Do I need to craft anything before I get out of here? I do remember that there was another recycler that I fixed, so on the way back. So I'm not too worried just yet about resources. Oh, nothing creepy in the washroom. Nothing creepy in the washroom. Excuse me. Nothing, right? It seemed like there might have been. I thought I heard something. Uh, nothing in the washroom, right? Not that I can check. Well, well, well. We're back here safely. What the hell? When did you have time to get there? Oh my god. Well, we gotta get rid of that. Oh! If I shoot the nest- Whoa! Okay, that's not the case. I was going to say that if you shoot the nest, the little kids die too, but I don't know what exploded them just now. Maybe the corpse. There's another one somewhere. Where? I want to get rid of them. I don't want them to, like, multiply. It does take a little bit of ammo. Oh, so they're not actually normally on fire. Oh. Maybe I can try throwing something at them. If I... if I can. Ah! Okay, that's a better use of objects around us than the, the glue gun, too. Cool. Out of psychotronics. Back to the lobby. This is scary. We don't know what kind of world it is outside there. Oh, was that always like that? It's been a long, long time since we've been here. In fact, I believe the last time when we were here, December was still trying to convince us to work with him. Or her, I guess. I guess. <laughs> it's a robot, so whatever. Escape. Whoa, that's really close to me. We're not even in the Neuromod division. Why, why can't I? It's big and fast. And it sees me. The nightmare is hunting you. Nightmare. Unknown Typhon organism. No entries found. Wonderful. The Typhon responds to an anomaly in their ecology. Something that's like them, but isn't. Me. Only purpose seems to be to hunt me down. Seems unstoppable. Well, I noticed we got a quest from that too. <laughs> Main story! <laughs> Evade or kill the nightmare. Use stealth or distraction to evade the nightmare until it leaves the area, or destroy it if you can. Oh, there's a timer! Oh. 
Seems unstoppable. So, is it actually unstoppable? Mm, I do have the Psychotronics door behind me, so if anything happens, I can run. Yeah. But I do want to try first, though, because I don't want to... Um, I don't want to escape for the rest of my life thinking that, Oh no, this is invincible, I can't kill it. Um, I just want to see the, the research again. They're here. Seems unstoppable. But it does have weaknesses. It does have weaknesses. I'm thinking maybe a null wave transmitter for starters would be good. Yeah, there's no... Oh, oh, okay, well, 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 I don't think we are going forward. No, I don't. Okay. What else? Q-beam? Might be a good time to... Um... Oh, it has a lot of HP. I'm in a good spot, though. It can't really hit me if it doesn't move. Oh? I wonder why it's not coming to get me. Like, I'm, I'm sure it's supposed to be, like, really strong and fast and everything, but I'm just wondering why it's not actually coming over here. Okay, maybe that's why. It was charging up. It was charging up. Okay, I don't have any more Q-beam. But it's okay. Jesus! Yeah, no, this is- this thing is not kidding. But we got it. Got it. It's not unstoppable. Oh god. 30 Typhon Organ. Well, oh! This must be the thing that was like hunting me in the Arboretum before. It's huge! It's huge. A response to something that's like them, but not. Is that because I got the Mimic Matter thing? <laughs> Come on, you guys can't be so stingy. I only used one point in there and you guys are getting mad already. Share the love. Okay, not that, not that. Actually, I don't think I need that though. <laughs> but maybe that, so maybe I should recycle that. Oh, and we can get out this way. But we don't need to, we don't need to. I wanna see what the world outside is like. See, because if I get out this way, that means my only escape plan is to come back this way, which means I need to like go through this long process of turning into a mimic again, which I think is a little bit hectic to do if I'm trying to escape. So let's just go this way. That thing opened the door on its own and everything. Oh my god. I should have ran over here and locked it. That's what I should have done. <laughs> it has a pretty distinct cry though. Wah wah wah! Dude, something like that. <laughs> We've already seen this, I think. Yep. Okay, so what is... Can you not open first? I just wanna... Yes, lock this, please. I just want to have a look at what the hell is going on outside. We have a nest. We have some cystoids just running around like they own the place. Actually, we have a lot... <laughs> There's a lot of nests around here. Yeah, maybe I should scan and see- Hey. Alice Icon. Oh, that's a- that's a phantom. That weaver's been scanned already. I wonder if it's the one that escaped containment. Okay. So, so far, it doesn't actually seem that bad. But the nests, we gotta- we gotta get them going. We don't have that much pistol ammo. That's not good considering how far away the weaver is. So, what I'm gonna do is... I will shotgun the nests. Turns out that was not a good idea. Who would have thought? Close it! <laughs> oh my god! Is it dead? Yeah, love me some fast reloading shotgun. I think I need to use the pistol for this. It's just that I don't have that many shots from it. Man, I don't know what the hell to throw at it, so... Oh! Oh my... 
get the hell in here. <laughs> oh my god! Well, at least we can scan them safely in here. Look at how many cystoids are here though, holy crap. Oh my god, the glass is broken! New ability, Phantom Genesis. Okay, that's cool, but I need to deal with the cystoids in front of me. <laughs> oh, that's not the right... That's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Get out, get out, y'all! Ow! There's a lot! Ooh! This doesn't help. I need to, like, throw stuff outside. Oh my god. Are they attracted to it? Ow, okay. There's a phantom outside, too, or something. Wait, does the weaver do that? Yeah, no, that's, a. Uh, it's Alice Iken! Alice Iken. I can't stand around anymore. I don't have enough medkits to do that. Don't have the kill beam. Very limited ammo, but we can probably get the phantom like that. Good lord. Oh, I accidentally like used and unused the the combat focus. Okay, I can't waste my shots like that. I'm just gonna have to make do, buddy. Just get that thing and go. Health, health. Okay, I think that was really the majority of the things that we saw here that was dangerous. Aside from this dude. This dude who doesn't really do anything aside from... Cystoids, right? So the best thing to do is probably to... Get it quickly. Oh no, my turrets. Oh wait, if I can fix my turrets! That'll make it faster. It's kind of like patrolling that area with my turrets though. I just want some help. My poor buddies! Man, I've got way too many parts. Time to get some of these guys working for me. I wonder if we can go in there. Can we get that to go away too? It's a little bit like... I might step in it. Okay, buddy. Why don't I attract you over here with... I guess a pistol shot is as good as any. Ah! Oh my lord! I'm really scared. Apparently. Whoa! How did this you need to come over here so I can get you with my turrets. Or do you want me to bring them to you? Close enough? Deploying. No, that's not coming over here at all. Oh, I don't like this. This lobby- Of course, the moment I pick up the freaking turret. I need to, like, bring them so that their forces are combined. These two turrets. Uh, now we know why the guts was good, because we can float around everywhere. But normally, <laughs> when we have gravity around here, <laughs> it's a little bit difficult to get the weaver unless if I have... Oh! <laughs> well, that's not good. That That is really not good. Hey, come over here! Too far to even care about me. Oh! Ow! I can't ever get it like this if I just... No, you know what? I'm just going to have to, like, not care about them for now. I need to go get some supplies, get some pistol shots, because this is just... ...wasting time. What's that? 
Are we still safe in here? What's that sound? Hello. Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Oh, am I ever glad to see you, buddy. Diagnosing. I want to check on that guy in the room. There. And there is a key. Don't forget to complete a patient questionnaire. Your feedback will be invaluable. Oh, but well, why is he? He's still controlled. Maybe it's another telepath that I need to kill? Mm. I don't really know how to, like, make it better for you. Guess you're staying in there for a little Hello. while longer. See you again, Dr. Yu. We can now hack this. I think I need to make some Q-beam stuff, too. The Q-beam was really good for the nightmare. I don't think I would have been able to kill it without the Q-beam. Regina Sellers. Re re re. Good Talos. In the event of a loss of atmosphere, gravity, or other serious emergency, please report to the nearest muster station. Dr. Yu, I'm ready for permission to access one of the patient files. Illusion. Michaela, my girlfriend, or my ex-girlfriend. I already spoke to Nurse Mata, then Dr. DeVries. Oh, the guy we're trying to look for the, um, the encryption key of. And both indicated that not all the medical reports were available, notably the ones at the Petersburg Transtar facility, and then again in Kiev, when she was cleared for station operations. All my, all my requests have been denied, and I was hoping you could help me with this matter. Patient files. Alex? Dr. Sellers, Engineer Illusion was cleared Earthside. What exactly is the problem here? She claims she needs a bi-weekly booster shot of neurostimprexin to offset mild physiognomic fatigue. But NSP is a treatment for many ailments, including white noise, paraphlexis, muscle par paralysis due to neuronal disorder. If it is late onset white noise, then this would explain why Illusion has Hello. no neuromods. See you again, Dr. Not Yu. simply because she has refused them, as she has claimed. Illusion's brain has never been scanned, which I also find unusual, especially for a trans star employee. I requested her files to see if any member of her family had a history of the disorder, but those of her parents are also not accessible. Not accessible. <laughs> Dr. Sellers, I know what paraflexes is. The records are sealed by government order, not Transtar. My hands are tied. This lady was trying to explain to Alex what the diseases were, but you know, Alex is CEO for a reason. He knows the stuff already. <laughs> a case of trying to someone trying to act smart in front of someone smarter than them. White noise. I do believe we read about it right here. Spots in the victim's eyes. It's a medical it's not just a medical condition. Which doctor like claims of physic psychic ability? It says the victim can never have a neuromod. Wait, so what does that mean? Mm, I have a vague idea of what it is, but even after reading this stuff, I'm not exactly sure. If you have white noise, you can't get neuromods because is it like a compatibility issue? You will be really, really not good. Muscle paralysis due to neuronal disorder. Anyway, for some reason, my ex-girlfriend is super secretive. Booster shots. Alejandro Mata. Alejandro, who is the NSP being administered to? Inventory shows a case of the booster shots are missing. Regina, sorry, should have informed you. NSP shot was for chief illusion. Mild physiognomic fatigue. Should have logged it. Oh, and this is why she was concerned, because this stuff was just going missing. Alejandro, please come see me. Can you transfer her charts and family records as well? Weird, I can't pull those up. They're not in the system. Still want me to swing by? We've read exactly this email on some other computer, and at that time, I thought that maybe Alejandro was stealing stuff to be... to be, um, smuggled off back to Earth or something. But no, now we know that it's the patient that's weird. Illusion. Michaela. Hmm. Something to keep an eye for. 
Lovely, how co- Wait. Was that person here before? Yes, yes they were. Yeah. Hello. Lovely how context adds a lot to these emails. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Like when you read them, sure, you'll get a little bit out of it, but when you have the full context then, that makes it a lot easier to understand. Okay, so... Yes, we can open this now. Henrik DeVries, Chief Surgeon. AKA the room that I've been trying to break into by the window the whole time. Chess. Axiom. Is that a cigarette brand? Oh my god. Even in space. You know, I would have assumed that this might be more tightly regulated in space because it pollutes oxygen. So I thought that might be something that people would be a little bit more strict about since oxygen is not something we have an unlimited amount of here. Actually, I do wonder how they get their unlimited source of oxygen here. Some sort of oxygen making machine? Cellular society. The social repercussions of medical technologies. Yet the effects of medical technology on society's norms can be more pronounced. To cite a recent example, one only has to recall cigarette use pff, was often frowned upon as a habit until advances in the food industry that allowed for consumable microspheres that captured and expelled cancer cells. What? From the body. Simultaneously, both the fear of cancer and the stigma attached to smoking vanished within a generation. Now smoking is perceived as no more harmful than drinking a soda. Wow. Wow. Expelling cancer cells from the body. Hey, for our sakes, I hope we get to that stage soon. I wonder how that would affect the cigarette industry though. I feel like they're making a lot of big bucks right now already, despite the, the whole health thing. So, if health was not an issue, my god. Could you imagine? Those tobacco company big wigs gonna be making the big bucks. Oh my gosh. Dr. DeFries is safe. Oh, we might have been able to find the code to it if we read his emails first. That's okay. Morgan Psyche Vows. Oh. Hendrik, I need you to remove all sensitive material regarding the Psyche Vows immediately. Of special importance are Morgan's log sessions. I need those materials in my office. From this point forward, only speak through an encrypted transcribe. I've sent you the decryption key. You should be able to download it from your workstation. There's some secrets in here. Subject for quarantine. Hendrik, Trevor Young is one of our scientists. He was exposed to our inner containment area without proper protection. He's gone through observation in psychotronics and had his most recent neuromods removed as a precaution. But we'd like to keep him under more standard quarantine until we can be certain that there are no lingering psychological effects. Work with Dr. Cole on this, thanks. Here it is. And now we can access the files too, can't we? Hmm. One step closer to finding out the truth. Listen to the decrypted transcribed message. Did I... Oh, that's the one that I picked up before. So the one... Transcribe... Uh, oh, we got that. No, we... Did we read this? Yeah, we did. Connected to the Typhon telepaths should avoid getting too close. Triggers a strong kinetic blast that knocks out Psy abilities, ends up killing them! Stun gun might take them out long enough to sneak past. Might be able to free them from Typhon control somehow. Ooh, I don't think we saw that part when we read this last time. Yeah, Morgan's notes. Anyway, uh, audio logs? This is not... To Henrik, though. Is that the right one? Hans, we 
We need to talk about Annalise Gallegos. Oh, that's it? Oh, oh, oh. Alex! Damn it. Hold on. I'm encrypting the rest of this. Okay. Dr. Cole already wiped the recording of Morgan's breakdown off his computer. The last copy is hidden in his office. I'm not going back. You'll have to get it yourself. A C B A C. Good luck. Cole's office or whose office? I missed it. Alex! Damn it. Hold on. I'm encrypting the rest of this. Okay. Dr. Cole already wiped the recording of Morgan's breakdown off his computer. The last copy is hidden in his office. Dr. I'm Cole. not going back. You'll have to get it yourself. A C B A C. Good luck. Oh. Find Greg Law. Have I heard this? I'm sure I've heard it, but I don't Officer remember what this Chia. one is. This is Chief Elazar. Ja here, Chief. How can I help you? I need you to report to deep storage oh, okay. and get Chief Show to reactivate the tracker on Grant Lockwood. HR deactivated it as part of the termination, but we don't have a record of him on the departing shuttle. I want to know where he is and escort him where he needs to go. On it, Chief. Hmm. So yeah, we've heard that one, and we need to go to deep storage to progress. Okay, Dr. Cole's office. Oh, how are we doing on the, the people, by the way? We found a good bit of them. Not enough. Not enough. We still haven't really found anyone alive yet. That really <clears throat> bothers me a little bit. Okay, Dr. Cole's office. The escape pod key is pretty close. Oh, it's right next door, isn't it? Yeah, that would make sense. It's the... It's this room. A... Oh god, I forgot the code already. But what do you mean, though? What can we... I'm sorry, but I probably have to listen to this once more. <laughs> Not this one. A C B A C. Good luck. A C B A C. I think it might be this thing. A C B A. Do I want to see this? Apparently I had a breakdown. Oh my god. Matthias Cole. You seem frustrated. It's me. I have months that are just gone. I've been listening to the logs, uh, reading the research, playing catch-up. Do you know how many times we've had this conversation? This is the fifth time. Does it always go the same way? Not always. What does that mean? What do you think it means? I think it means you should be concerned as my counselor. You left yourself a message. Would you like to listen to it? No. I think it would help. I said no. That's not me. Well, Why do you say that? Maybe I, I can help know. you. I just know. You agreed to this. This was all your idea. Yours and Alex's. I didn't agree to any of this. That Morgan is not me. I would never. Do you know what's going on in Psychotronics? Do you? If I did, I couldn't say. You know that. What do you know about the Typhon? <laughs> we shouldn't talk about them. Not without your brother present. Them. You do know, you snake. How can you sit there? Morgan, take a deep breath. Here. I don't want a pill. I want this station shut down. I want Earth- Morgan! I said no! <sighs> okay. I'm going to call Alex. Interesting. Morgan would not consider the other Morgans herself. Even though they are. The Morgans that have had mods taken in and out. Interesting. Should I use that to guide my behavior? I 
don't know. Like, it's so strange. Hearing yourself say things that you have no recollection of. It's too weird. Too weird. Was that the last of that quest? No, yeah, that was just a pointer for me to see what I was like previously. But not really a pointer for me to act according to a certain... Like, act according to a certain way. Hmm. Okay. Well, 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 well. I think we can get necropsy. Five. We got some more skills here from scanning whoever the hell. Oh, fear resistance. That would be so good. Oh, reduces duration. Not completely. Okay, maybe not that good. Night. Shield. Oh, these look really tempting. <laughs> No, the other one that I wanted to get is hack level 4. Actually, I should probably get some more inventory space too. Yeah. I'm going to focus on the normal Hello, ones first. If we have some extra ones to play with, then I'll I'll think about the Typhon powers. Not too crazy for them. They're neat. Don't get me wrong, they are very neat. But Good afternoon, Talos. Lunch I'm a little wary. I'm a little bit wary about, again, becoming an alien. Please refer to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. It's been a while since I've been here. January, have you been... Ooh. Why is my door open again? Oh my god. This is bullshit. Who keeps opening my door? Oh, you're alive! Hey, January. I have more autonomy than a typical operator. The contents of the video are sensitive. Only a flesh and blood person could handle the responsibility, I presume. Do you feel resentment about that? <laughs> okay. Well, I don't think... Yeah, there's not too much new here, is there? There is that video. See, this is weird, because in my psych eval, Morgan would not consider a recorded Morgan herself. But this one is like, hey, watch me, Morgan. That seems a bit... That No, that actually seems really contradictory. That, that makes me pause a little bit. And it makes me very confused. I don't know who to trust. And I don't have anything to recycle. That's not good. Can I make anything, though? I need to make some stuff. I need more of the... Where can I find more, like, metal metal products? To... Can I break this, by the way? This is glass, right? So technically, if I don't need it anymore... I kind of regret doing that. But it seems like we might have uncovered a new path. This is dangerous. General access. Is this a secret door? Ah, you little shit. the heck are we? Oh, it's a back door into my office. Well, not really a back door because we're not meant to go through the glass like that. <laughs> Somebody's here. Where is this? I don't really... Whoa, there's a lot of phantoms there. Where is this? I don't think we've been here before because there's still a heart there. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Maintenance access only. Ah, it goes to the other side. Oh, we haven't been here yet because we have the general access key now. We can access a lot more things. 
yeah, why not take this time to look around our beautiful world a little bit? No, we've been here. We've been here another way. Okay. That's cool. Where- Um, that means that glass area is the room directly below us. Let's pick this up. IT security. Yeah, we haven't been to HR yet, even though we can go in there. Sure, let's open this. I would rather open a door than break some glass. It just seems kind of caveman-like to me. And I'm totally okay with not making noise to attract more Typhons, so... Yeah. Why oh, didn't that? Integrity damaged. Stay down, buddy. It's funny how they like they actually stay down. <laughs> Didn't really use it. Ooh. Oh, I think there was a nest in here somewhere. <laughs> Hearing a phantom say that, that's rich. I can't take them that seriously, though. Remember, they're like parrots. They don't know what the hell they're saying. They probably don't even speak English. It is just so strange how they say that about themselves, of all the people. <laughs> Authorized personnel only. I basically own this entire place. How can I not have the keycard for that? Oh, that was a marker. This goes to... Oh, this is the other side. Yeah, we've been here before. Mhm. Mm cool, cool. We're finally coming back to the lobby to look at this stuff a little bit. Computers are not really- Oh. Is that the key I need? It better be. Suit integrity issues. Where are, where are the freaking engineering mods around here? Oh. No. IT supply closet. I don't have it. Hmm. It might be around here somewhere, or maybe we have to find the guy in charge of IT and try to see if it's on his body. No smoking. Yeah, so there are some places that you can't smoke in, and some places that you can. Wow, I've said absolutely nothing of value. 